I collect all of my practice nails. You guys always talk about this very specific one and it is the cheese nail. Fun fact, this is actually a video I did in March. Let's roll the clip. And I, in fact, did not get the cheese touch because I was wearing gloves. As you know, I wear gloves in all my videos. I used my tapered square nail tips and all I did was drill holes. The yellow acrylic I will be using is Belle. It's the perfect cheese color. Since I'm using an acrylics acrylic powders, I was able to move and mold my acrylic wherever I wanted and it took literally no effort. Here I am drilling the nail so it's even all around and doing a few little fixes. We're ready for top coat. Okay, this came out pretty cute. Let me know what you think down below. Hey guys. So as you all know, I have a ton of old practice nails. So today I will be recreating one of them and making it better. This is today's victim. <sighs> Do I have to explain myself? I went for a rainbow French design and it was so uneven. So let's fix it. I'll be using my products to create this look. So starting off, I'm using my taper square nail tips with latte. For my red, I'm using Ariel. Oh my god, we're going so fast. For my orange is Moana, yellow is Belle, green is Tiana, and so far, I'm like, okay, this looks pretty cute. For my blue, I'm using Frosty from my winter collection. And the last color of the rainbow is Rapunzel. I'm not even gonna lie to you guys, this nail literally took me like two hours to do, but it was totally worth it. So now I just gotta add my top coat. Wait, hold on, we gotta make that a little bit more satisfying. Can you guys taste the rainbow? Let me know how I did down below. Hey guys, I have a lot of old practice nails and I started my own mini collection. I was looking for these two specific nails. First I did the pink one for Valentine's Day, then I did the green one for fun. And a lot of you guys pointed out that I should do a blue one to make a Powerpuff Girls collection. So that's exactly what I'm gonna do. For my base color, I'm using Cinderella. It's a beautiful light blue color. I have a difficult time when it comes to nail art, but I do try my best. I think I slowly have been getting better, and sometimes people be coming at me crazy, but I just want to remind you guys that I'm learning just like you are. For this nail design, I'm using three different blue colors. Let's add some top coat, and we're done. Here is Ms. Bubbles. Now my collection is complete and ready for the nail jar. Hey guys. So today I want to recreate one of my old nail designs and you won't believe what I found. Look at this. I think this is my first Easter nail design I've ever done. I remember I didn't even have a nail brush to do this and it even had a little hair on it. Oh my God. So I'm going to recreate the nail design years later. I'm using an acrylics taper square nail tips and I will be using the color lemonade as my base color. You guys, this literally looks like straight butter. So satisfying. Now that that's done, I'm gonna go ahead and file. Oh my god, I'm so rude. I forgot to say happy Easter, guys. I hope everybody had a wonderful day. I'm having a huge sale. 25% off my Easter bundle and 20% off everything else. Link in bio. So I didn't want to just have a plain bunny, but I want to have a bunny with a flower crown. Look how cute it looks. I think it turned out so cute. Let me know what you think down below.